Hi friends, Mike Eccles here, and my message today is to stay woke. The novel coronavirus is ravaging our country right now. I mean, cities and counties, they're working like crazy to assure that their citizens are protected and that they can get back to work as soon as we've come out of this crisis. But uh, as we go through this and we see the over 400,000 infections and the more than 10,000 deaths, we also have to stay woke because essentially we depend on electricity and power much the way that we expect for our health care system to be there when we need it. While this situation continues to be heavily scrutinized in response to the approach that's been taken to serve citizens. Can you imagine if we lost power during this time? Can you imagine if all the remote connectivity and your ability to use a laptop or even your phone was disrupted during this stay at home time in our lives, what would we do? How would we handle it? Would the government do a better job than they're doing with the response to COVID-19? Probably not. But let me just tell you that over the last two years, uh, government officials and industries have been warned that the lights are blinking red for a cyber attack in the same way that they were blinking red prior to the attacks of 9-11. And the issue here, our electrical system, our power grid, it has issues, has a lot of vulnerabilities. Vulnerabilities that can be exploited by our biggest adversary. Russia, Iran, China, and these flaws in our system are not a secret. They're known. And it's been said many times that there are other countries in our grid. People say that we're in their grid also. But my point is the potential for you to lose electrical power for a long period of time is absolute and you as an individual need to stay woke you need to have the ability to manage and maintain for a period of time should you have no electricity this is going to be critical for you taking care of your family and managing your life should it occur can it occur most certainly so, um, thanks to the steady supply of electricity, we're all living pretty good right now if you have opportunity to work from home. For some people, that doesn't exist, and I acknowledge that. But for the most part, we can keep our society going right now because we can telework because we can do things like telehealth. All of these uh, communications mechanisms require one thing, and it's electrical power. So just stay woke and understand that none of these things happen magically. And when we get through this COVID situation, you should be on the phone to your congressman or your senator trying to get them to understand that you do care. You do care that the power generation systems are up to standard and hardened so that hackers can't go in and take away our electrical power. Should that occur? it may leave us in a worse situation than COVID-19 has done to us. This is Mike Eccles, and I'll see you soon.